What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, cups, and sides, and everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages to resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading for all signs. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Royal Five. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only. No cash up, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. Um, thanks, everybody, for all the new subscribers. I really appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you think anyone else would like my channel, please feel free to share it very publicly via social media. It's a word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. And <clears throat> I mentioned it on the Daily Tea earlier today, and I'll mention it again. Um, I plan on doing a giveaway at 20,000 subscribers. We're at 13,000 something, something, like almost 700 or something like that. Um, at 20,000, I will um, do another giveaway. I've done about three since, because uh, I started from zero subscribers and built it up over the course of two and a half years, this channel, for anybody who doesn't know. Um, I didn't use any promotion people, any fake um pay you $200 and you give me 200 subscribers and 50,000 likes. I, I didn't use any of that. I, I built it up through a lot of hard work from zero subscribers to what I'm at now over the course of two and a half years. So um, at 20,000, and I've done three giveaways since then. The last one was at 10,000. It was free readings. So at 20,000, I'm going to do another giveaway. So just to let everybody know, for the newbies just joining, um, if you want to tell a friend or friends or a friend of me or a family member, if you think they would like my channel, um, I plan on doing another giveaway at 20,000, okay, when I hit the 20,000 subscriber mark. Um, I do love and appreciate each and every one of you guys, and I hope the channel helps you in some shape, form, or fashion. Of course, remember, as always, the readings are not going to resonate. Every single one's not going to resonate for every single person because you have to plug the message or messages into your own life situation and story however they resonate and apply in your own life because everybody's different. So uh, just keep that in mind, okay? These are psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages. So one may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. You have to plug the message or messages in how they resonate. Love you guys. Okay, so I received a channeling, so I'm going to deliver it, okay? Um, psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages, okay? Uh, I already did the daily tea today, so that's up and posted under the live. You just uh, click on the live tab, uh, recent live streams, and it'll pull up if you want to view the live of today or any lives. Um, I was a little confused on how to pull up the lives myself on other readers uh, before I started reading, so um, sometimes I like to get that information on here because it, um you kind of have to like search for it or unless somebody tells you so anyways okay so the channel message i received was um an aries um uh, an aries is really 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 uh, trying to hide the fact that they have stolen a large amount of money from a feminine energy some an ex um co-worker subordinate some a community member, but through many shocking, and some a family member, some a family member. So some of these Aries, they have stole, for some of you guys, I feel they've stole from you. Now, I'm not downing Aries. I just want to make that clear. I'm not downing Aries. Um, and not at all. This is just what I'm picking up. There's some low vibrational Aries thieves out there, and I'm just being for real. Do I, am I saying all my Aries are low vibrational thieves? No. No, no, no. I think you guys know these people is what I'm trying to say. For some, you can be another Aries and the Aries stole from you. I mean, you have to plug these people in how they resonate. But I'm pulling this in, I'm feeling, because somebody has stole from you is what I'm feeling, okay? But you plug these low vibrational Aries into your own life how they resonate. Now, low vibrational is people that do not treat people with honesty, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values, i.e. the low vibrational behavior of the thievery. I heard they are really hoping basically hoping and praying that somebody um uh, well not somebody that people i think society doesn't find out or a group or society or maybe their workplace for some or their family or the community doesn't find out that they stole from a fem energy some of these fem energies and i feel for some you're the fem energy from a fem energy 
for some of these fem energies, they are a former coworker, i.e., I heard a subordinate. So they were a subordinate, i.e., a rank or ranks below them in a workplace. So they wasn't even on equal playing grounds or equal pay grade field, but yet they had the audacity to steal from this person. What? <laughs> That is so insane in the mem I mean that you shouldn't feel period, but especially if you're making more money than them in the workplace situation, that is so wrong, so wrong. So some it was in a workplace situation, some subordinate energy. So one level or two or two plus levels underneath them. So meaning they got paid more money than the fem energy, but yet they had the audacity to steal from. It. What? So that's terrible. Some it's a family member. So family members stole from the fem energy. Uh, I feel it's you fem energy they stole from. And for some, it's a community member. So your fem energy community member that this Aries stole from, I feel they are a community member of yours. And like I said, for some, you're a family member, a uh, fem family member of this Aries and this Aries stole from you. For some, you're a fem subordinate of this Aries. You made less money than this Aries. And yet they held the audacity and the greed to steal from you anyways because they could what that's so terrible i heard they were hoping and praying they would not be exposed but there are many series of chain events they're about to be well they should be and hopefully they get jailed because this is terrible terrible we've had so much thievery in here recently so much quit stealing from folks and that's just the truth i mean it's terrible it's terrible I mean, I don't know the life situation on you, Fem Energy. I mean, I don't know. I don't know if you're single as a Pringle or you're a single uh, mother or um, or you have five mil in the bank. I don't know and I don't care. Nobody should steal from you and that's just the truth. Nobody should steal from you. It's about to be exposed from someone they would have never expected. It is about to mortify the hell out of them. It's about to be revealed from someone they would have never expected. It's about to mortify the hell out of them. Someone they never thought would speak on it. And they're about to. To cover their ass. Okay, I heard it's about to be revealed from someone. So you feminine energies, the ones that were stole from, whether the Aries is a family member, a community member, or a former boss of yours, manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO of yours. Someone this Aries, it could be masculine or feminine Aries. They could have Aries in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or feminine, hand with Jupiter's hearts. But someone they would have never expected, never in a million years, I feel like, would have never thought to reveal this information. I heard they're about to, to cover their own ass. You, Aries, should have known this person was about, it was going to do it. They are about to do it. Okay, I heard you, so you Aries, you low vibrational Aries, if you watch my channel, sir or ma'am, I feel maybe one of you guys, you do, um, there's at least three Aries thieves out in the universe, I'll tell you that, um, from Fem Energies, at least three, um, but you low vibrational Aries, I heard you should have known this person was going to do it, you should have known this person you thought would never say anything, never speak up about it, never do anything, you should have known this person would do it, I think this person has a history Maybe they're a whistleblower or maybe they are um, they stand up for injustices or rights or liberties or freedoms or maybe they just betray people. I mean, I'm not sure. However, that resonates, Aries. But I heard you would have, uh, you thought this person would never say anything, but you should have known they were going to. So I think you're into, oh, well, I don't think, I know your intuition was way off point with this person. Because I heard you never thought they would say anything, but yet they're about to. So, obviously, your intuition was way off with this person. It was way off. And it's about to create many, 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 many negative series of chain events for this low vibrational Aries. Okay, I heard it was way, way, way off. So, low vibrational Aries, it, your intuition was way off with this person. I didn't hear a sign on this person. You have to plug this person in. However, they resonate. It can be masculine or femme. Any sign. But your intuition was way off of this person. And I heard um, once they reveal this information, it's about to create many negative series of chain events for you, Aries. You shouldn't have stole, though. I mean, I can't say I don't feel sorry for you because you should not steal. 
And the crappy part, I mean, you should none of these situations, you shouldn't still period, point blank. Period, point blank. But especially the one in the workplace dynamic where you made more money than this person. That is so terrible. So terrible. Any of them's terrible, but especially that one. Main male. Thief. Oh, my Lord. Except it, uh, I heard take it reversed. It came reversed on the floor. I heard take it reversed. Okay. But I heard, uh, the, the, I mean, you're a thief, low vibrational Aries. You're a thief. I don't feel sorry for you. I really don't. I have sympathy for a lot of people in the world, but not thieves. Not thieves and not pedophiles. And that's just the truth. Um, whoever you are, you can be masculine or feminine. But you shouldn't have done it in any of these situations. But it's Especially the boss situation. That is terrible. Number one or 24 could be very significant numbers in one's life. Number one or 24, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number in one's life. Number one or 24. I think you, Femme Energies, you're about to get justice in this, but it's about to come from someone this Aries would have never. I mean, this Aries intuition is very off. It's very off. Um, they, are they, they never thought this person would do it. But they're about to do it. And I heard spiritual confirmation in here that their intuition was off. It was off, is off, still off. I mean, how? I, I, I don't know. I'm not this Aries. I'm not this situation. Dear Lord. Main male upright. But you, Femme Energy, you're about to get justice for this, universal justice, through this person and this situation. Because this person's about to stand up. I, all this is about to go on behind the scenes in your life, Femme Energy. Whether you're the family member of this Aries, a community member of this Aries, or a former subordinate in a workplace situation of this Aries. This is about to go on behind the scenes, so you're not going to know this. Nobody's going to come to you and tell you this. This is going to happen not in your energetic space, behind the scenes, ma'am. This resonates for you, okay? But it's about to benefit you. Main male upright, thief reversed. A masculine energy that truly, 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 truly cares about this feminine energy does not want to steal from her in any shape, form, or fashion. Not at all. He wants her to get justice, and he's about to speak up in a huge way and get her justice. For some, it's a feminine that takes on a heavy masculine energy. Okay, so you go with your bad self, sir, ma'am. So it's at least two of you guys. There's at least three situations in here, three fem energies. So there's many situations in here. You have to plug yourself in where you fit. So at least three fem energies that were stole from from an Aries, low at, with, from the low vibrational Aries. So at least three situations, at least two people about to stand up. Now you have to plug yourself into the situation where you fit. Are you the thiever, low vibrational uh, Aries thiever? Are you the fem energies that was stole from, or were you the people about to stand up for this situation behind the scenes from the fem energy? I heard you really, really, really care about this fem energy. I don't think it's like a, ooh, baby, I want to use you and abuse you and one night stand you. I think it's it's a from a heart chakra place, like a caring connections kind of place. It can be a platonic caring connections kind of place or a uh, possibly want to date you down the line caring connection kind of place. Um, however, that resonates, but it is from a heart chakra space here. It's not from a sexual sex wine kind of place is what i'm trying to say which is good um because whether you decide whether this is from a dating you know and possible but dating situation down the line or not or just platonic at least you know that it's coming from the heart at least you know it's coming from the heart in a humanity kind of way like a humane right thing to do kind of way um and if you're going to date somebody date them for the right reasons that's the way i look at it but um, but this is not about dating or any of that. This is just a caring, platonic, heart chakra coming from the heart space because it's the right, humane thing to do is what I'm taking it. 
from this. So if you fit into this category down here, you're either a masculine energy that really cares about these femme energies and you know about this person, or you are a femme that takes on heavy masculine about to do this because you know about this person and you know about these femme energies that were stole from in this situation. You have to plug yourself in where you fit, sir, ma'am. One, you're a masculine energy about to do this. One, you're a femme that takes on heavy masculine. You're pulling up as the main male upright. So um, the femme that takes on heavy masculine, you're pulling up as the main male upright because you take on the heavy masculine because everybody takes on masculine and femme energies. So that's why you're pulling up as the main male upright, if you're wondering. So, um, but to at least two of you guys about to do this. One, you're a masculine. One, you're a femme that takes on heavy masculine. You're both pulling up as the main male upright. Um, you don't, I heard you don't want to steal from this person. You don't want to steal from these, this femme energy. You don't want to steal from them. You have no desire to steal from them. I think you want to connect with this person or reconnect with this person, but you know there has been a huge injustice done, like crimes against humanity or um, just the right, and you want to do the right thing. And that's why you're about to step up. I think you're about to advocate for this situation. And uh, I do. I feel adv advocacy energy here because of the theft. I heard this person does not want it to come out. And I think at least two of you guys know about this. So I think more people know about it than, I think this Aries knows way more people know than they want to know. I, a lot of people know, and it's about to come out. A lot of people know, and it's about to come out. Okay, so I heard a lot of people know, and it's about to come out. But at least two of you guys, lovely citizens, is about to be advocates for this situation. I love it, because I... I believe in advocacy. I'm a huge, strong believer in advocacy, a huge believer in it. It makes the world a better place. Um, so I heard a lot of people know about it, but at least two of you guys are about to stand up and be true advocates. Now, you don't have to be a healthcare professional. You don't have to be legal sector. You don't have to be a social worker. You don't have to be a police officer, officer of the law to be an advocate. Any single individual citizen of the world can be an advocate for person, people, place, or situation. Period, point blank. So you don't have to be a title and a stature and a status to be an advocate. Now, nurses, they're mandatory reporters. They are advocates. Uh, I'm a nurse. I know that. But um, medical professionals, advocates, mandatory reporting. I mean, there's but there's many mandatory reportings. I just use that as an example because I'm a nurse. But my point is, you don't have to be any specific title to be an advocate. You can be any, a hu just a human person living the human experience to be an advocate so whoever you are sir ma'am whether you have a fancy job title or whether you don't i don't know but you're about to oops you're about to stand up and be an advocate to these spin energies you know about the situation i heard, but i heard many people know about the situation so that's why this person i think is sweating in their boots or sweating in their skin or sweating wherever they go um because they know so many more people know than they want to know basically It's about to create many, 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 many negative series of chain events for these thieves. They should have done the right thing in the past, and they didn't. It's about to create basically a crap ton of negative series of chain events for the Aries, low vibrational Aries thieves. They should have done the right thing in the past, and they chose not to. So they made the free willing choice to steal from these fem energies, and they made the free willing choice to do it, and made the free willing choice to go through with it. And so now here comes their karma in the form of these people, the advocates. I love you guys down here. Just saying, just saying. All right, you guys. Well, I think we're done. Let me see if I hear anything else. Respect are about to come to these people in huge ways. Respect are about to come to these people in huge ways. So honor and respect is about to come to you, sir, ma'am, whoever you are. I heard respect is about to come to you in huge ways. You're about to stand up when people are um, basically refuse to stand up for thieves. Whoever you are, sir, ma'am. You're about to stand up for a situation where nobody, many people knew about it, but yet wanted to keep it quiet and keep it covered up. But you are about to stand up for it. I heard honor and respect is about to come to you. Man, you're my kind of person, whoever you are, sir, ma'am. I like it. I like it a lot. 
All right. I love you guys so much. Everybody have a wonderful night, day, whatever it is to you in the world. And if you think anyone else will like my channel, please feel free to share it. Love you. Namaste.